with the gourmet chef scenario completed, it's time to move on to our next scenario. And as much as I'd like to do the auto mechanic one, we'll save that for last and just go sequentially with the store clerk simulation. So let's get on in there. Oh my gosh. I don't think I've ever gotten that on the first try. So come on back. And we'll try that again. Oh, second try. Third time's a charm, right? Kobe. Oh my gosh. <laughs> I really thought that was good. All right, very slowly. Are you a fan of slushies and hot dogs? You'll love the convenience store. Convenience store? I hope it is convenient, though we're working there, so we are the ones creating the convenience, perhaps. Let's see how it looks. Wow. Hello, human. Welcome to an accurate simulation of convenience store clerk. Take a look at this board for instructions and grab a ticket when you're ready to get started. Okay, so we've got tickets this time. I guess they've been different in the previous ones. But let's take a moment before that to look at what we have going on. So we have some, it's called soda, not pop. How rude. <laughs> I'm definitely calling it pop. Pop would be my preferred nomenclature for this liquid. Um, but these are empties, which we have been chugging. So is there a trash can around? There's recycling. Perfect. Get those in there. Ooh, one perfect shot. Next second one, not so much. So we've got uh, take a coin, leave a coin. That should kind of be out front, right? Because uh, the customers have to use it. And oh, this is not very good at all. Hours are 5 a.m. to 11 p.m. So at least we're not here 24 seven, but every day the human has to be working. So unfortunately, JobBot, the shift manager is not giving us much time off. We have um, some Pepto-Bismol, which is not a tasty beverage but we may need that. Uh, it's gonna relieve nausea, burning heart, and <laughs> butt leakage. <laughs> oh, we gotta watch out for the butt leakage. So a, a Twinkie as well. Nice, we'll save the other half later, right on top of the, uh, the Pepto. And so what's this guy? Oh, nothing I can grab. So he's just decoration, I suppose. And then we have another shifting machine. Oh, safe. What is in the safe? Are we going to get robbed later? I have a feeling that we're going to get robbed, aren't we? Is that part of the convenience store experience? <laughs> oh, so it seems pretty easy to... Oh, the cheese. <laughs> a pretty easy combination. But let's keep our cheese nice and locked up. So next, some other stuff. We'll discover that later. Um, the sale matic with no cash in it. So we'll have to get that a bit later. It looks like it's going to make our change for us and uh, make things easier. So ketchup, we gotta put the ketchup back in the holder. How does that work? Woo! Oh, we don't even squeeze it, it just kind of flows out. The scanner, lottery tickets, ooh, very cool. So maybe I can play that and get out of this job, or at least negotiate for some better hours. And we have, uh, it looks like a key goes in there, and hot dogs, the best. So don't know where the actual hot dogs are. I guess they're in the, the fridge, but we'll make those a little bit later. We've got some uh, some gum as well. The Big Rom Firewire Blazing Fast Gum. And I don't know how to eat this because I don't know really know how to open it. And I can put it back. Cool. But the next one is Gigabyte Electric Mint Virus Free Gum. Okay. 16 bits. <laughs> I guess it's not quite a gigabyte. And um, some more magazines. And again, you would think these would be self-serve from the customer, but uh, apparently not. But slushies. 100 for 100, that's pretty good if you want 100 slushies to die off of them. And how about that? So we've got like a, a vacation bot. Well, there's really no mention of vacation, but it kind of seems like foreshadowing for a potential future vacation simulator, which I know you guys know is out. <laughs> but it would be cool if that was more explicitly mentioned and it was like a teaser for the future game. So this does something. Oh, okay, that is changing the camera. So if we turn that on, ooh, how about that? I am invisible. You can just see my hands. But we can take a look around, and I don't know what this is going to help us with, except for ruining my computer's performance. So let's check out the first ticket, which, again, should be for the customers, right? Take a ticket. All righty. Let's get to business. Here's your first customer. Cool. I don't think I have to do anything until he comes around. I guess here he comes. Good afternoon, human. I would like to purchase these. Chips. Chips. All right. So you've got some triangle ranch flavored Doritos. No, they're not Doritos. There's no barcode on here. But it will scan. Uh, put it in the bag. 
Could I also get one of those meat cylinders, please? A meat cylinder? Heck yeah. Dogs are in the freezer. Make sure you heat them up. At least a little bit. A little bit. Why wouldn't I heat them to their full potential? So let's check it out. In the freezer are the meat cylinders. Ah, here they are. Let's send all of them onto the roller, which I guess doesn't really need to be thought anywhere. Let's just pop them on there. And they seem to be working. Kind of uh, displaced them. They're now rolling, so let's get them all separated. Everyone's got to have their own little home. <laughs> so very... Oh no, they're burning! Oh, I destroyed the hot dogs! I didn't realize that could happen. This is one crazy hot dog roller. And these are going to just be... Well, I'll eat them. I'll eat damaged hot dogs. Well, I guess I won't. There we go. Yeah, tasty enough for me, right? Let's get that one out of there, out of this drawer. Whoa! It's a magic hot dog going through the bottom. So we need some more hot dogs. Let's just do one package this time, or one ice block worth. What are you doing? Why are you following me everywhere? Both of them. <laughs> okay. Hot dogs are all done. That looks acceptable. Hurry up and scan that so I can get eating already. Gotta eat one myself. It's been a busy day already. You're my first customer. <laughs> so I guess this is scannable. Woo! You can just hand that hot dog to me, human. Okie doke. Enjoy. A bunch. Here, take a couple extra. To finalize a sale, pull the lever on the register. Don't I need your money first? Uh, as far as I know, she didn't give me anything. But we've got hot dog there, and supposedly the triangles have been added earlier. Yes, total three ninety-eight. All right, here's your paper currency. Sweet. So that goes in there. Close that up, and you get a coin back. Well, come on, give me some credit. I know how these transactions work, so what is it? In job we trust. <laughs> nice. Change, change. So I'm going to swap this out, see if she'll notice. Nope. <laughs> Thanks. Have a profitable day. Oh, I surely will try. So cool. We have a successful transaction. Wasted some hot dogs, though. I don't know how much these cost. Hopefully we've at least broken even. I'll eat them, and then maybe they'll get taken to my paycheck. Right, JobBot? If I can't even find my mouth. What happened there? All right, I just launched it somehow. Come on, get in your mouth. <laughs> okay. Next task is what exactly? It was important Whew. for stores like this to maintain a constant stream of customers so that cashiers wouldn't have time to contemplate their rapidly approaching obsolescence. Ooh, ouch. Well, hello. Hey, buddy. Um, are we just... Yep. Easy enough. <laughs> Would you kind of... Ah, yes. Much better. Hmm. I'll take one of those frozen slushy delights. Oh, perfect. That is what I was hoping you would say. So we need slushy machine. It says slushy, right? Okay, I have two different things here. I forgot. What is jumbo? I gotta take a look. <laughs> as much as I want to leave that for when it's required. What in the heck? Oh, that's some kind of like battlefield. Hmm. So it's unclear right now. Maybe it makes things bigger? Huh. Let's try a coin. Woo! Oh, it does! Okay, so it had an icon for... Well, I wonder if we can use this coin. <laughs> no, it's too big to fit in the register. Here, you can just have that, buddy. But uh, it had the icon for making a slushy bigger, so perhaps that's what we have to do later. And I have a Twinkie, which is half a Twinkie right now. Woo! So now we've got, like, full-size worth of Twinkie, <laughs> which is still just one bite. What else can we supersize? Uh... Noodles. So we've got like insta noodles. Ah, <laughs> that's awesome. Everything's gonna have to be big. That's not gonna fit in there anymore. Uh oh. <laughs> so what were we supposed to be doing here? Oh yeah, slushy machine. Hopefully the cups are in there, and they are. So, boop. and what, what flavor do you want? Seems like he's got blue on there. So let's give him some blue. Would you kindly jumbo size that? Yes, I will. So he's. Got the battery acid blue, and we're going to jumbo it, but he needs a lid. I mean, that one's got a lid. Uh, I don't know where our lids are. Did I miss them? Were they on the slushy machine? No. But you know what this thing needs? It needs some hot dog. <laughs> so let's grab... Come on, get out of here. Instant noodles will eat you later. 
We're gonna heat these up. Pay no mind to what's happening behind the counter. So these look pretty good. Throw some. Wow, no! Spilled the slushy. We'll start off with hot dogs then. Oh no! It's hot dog proof. <laughs> Darn! <laughs> Is it bun proof? It's everything proof. How dare they? Well, let's head back to the slushy machine, and I guess we'll do it your way, job bot. So some battery acid blue. And then head over to the jumbo. The jumbo later. Oh, I love the Sweet. taste of sugar. Here, you can have that, because it didn't work. I couldn't throw it in here. Well, now that it's big, and has a huge top. Oh, it's still. <laughs> There's a force field. So we have to scan this guy. Oh, you're very good at scanning. Now, would you pass that to me? Sure. Here you go, pal. Oh, I forgot. Uh, is that how it works? And here's <laughs> Could some be. banknotes for you. Keep the change, good human. <gasps> Keep the change? Oh, yeah. Whoa, you're spilling, bud. I'll keep that over there. So, one more task. Uh, things have become a little bit messy, but we'll let the next person deal with that on their shift, which appears to be me, so <laughs> I'll just procrastinate that for another day. Ooh, that should have gone in. Just resting on the lip. I'll take a paper copy of yesterday's news. Okay, so... I guess they're all yesterday's news. Uh, seems easy enough. What's on the back here? Job bot of the year? Is that you? Is that you, buddy? Did you put that there? This is your simulation, right? <laughs> and I don't see a barcode on here either, but I guess it will scan. Uh, and I guess you want that. And Anything else? I'll take my daily lottery ticket as well. Okay, a lotto ticket. Uh, which one? Which... I... Doesn't seem to indicate anywhere. Um... So I'm going to give you this one. It's hit the lumber jackpot for $8 million or so. So let's, do you want that jumbo? <laughs> uh, I guess that will also work. Oh dear, I'm feeling a little faint today, dearie. Do you think you could scratch that lottery ticket for me? You can use my quarter. You got it. Now what here are... I, oof. Our numbers are... Numerous, <laughs> to say the least. So I'm hoping that doesn't have to match up with what's here. Oh, I oh. guess I won't be getting those upgrades today. Oh, well, here. Let's try and find you a better one. Let's try and play this one again. No. <gasps> there you go! We won for you! No? <laughs> I guess, uh... Here, give me that back, if, you're, if you don't want it. Take that. I want just this. Yeah. Here, if you're not going to be happy about it, you can take your losing card again. Nope. Alright, here, fine. Put it, it's in your bag. <laughs> and I'm just going to have to hang on to this guy and then cash out a bit later. So let's record the sale. Let me just write you a check for those. There we are. A check? What am I supposed to do with a check? It's for... Three dollars. Three dollar signs. I guess that's enough. Um, and we're gonna, I guess, keep the check. Okay, we'll deal oh, with that a later. Young human you are. The check better not bounce. Have a lovely day. <laughs> Thank you. Uh, though you look very miserable, I appreciate the sentiment. And I, I did steal everything from you, so... Sorry. <laughs> so, it's our first day in the convenience store. We're going to have to do some cleaning up. Not sure what kind of tool we're going to get for that. But we've learned some valuable lessons about hot dogs and about uh, pocketing smuggle bucks winning up to $4 million uh, despite not being able to interpret what these numbers mean. So thank you guys for watching this episode, our first time in the convenience store. Uh, as always, like and subscribe if you're interested in the channel and comment down below. Let me know what you thought of the video. But thanks for watching this one, and I'll see you in the next video.